it's a truly today, beautiful Nash. evening. A night that is absolutely ideal for a game Portugal. of football. The scenes here really are something. A beautiful picture under the floodlights. Traffic and transport round here, not the kindest. But regardless of that, the fans have found a way of getting here. There is a sense of theatre and the decibel levels are rising. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. Well, this is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Bruno Fernandes is one of the truly outstanding midfielders. He's someone I see as being arguably the best of the, the crop in the current generation of box-to-box -box playmakers. I really like his, his direct style, both on and off the ball. Yeah, he would be the obvious choice, wouldn't he? He certainly has all the right qualities. Oh, it's a promising build-up. There's plenty of really nice passing. He's got away. Has a goal! And he's there to get it away. Lovely ball into space. Could move up a gear here. Octavio. He's a sharp little ball here. He's in here! Araujo. For Valverde. So a third of the match or thereabouts gone, and we still await the first goal. And he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Bentancur. Jimenez. And it's Cavani. To Arascaeta providing an outlet on that foot. Cavani! Just off target. Cavani certainly could have and should have made more of that. Ruben Neves spread out to the left. Nuno Mendes. Oh, he's found support out wide. He's left his man. Gets to show off his quick feet. Well, they're looking at the referee, but he's waved play on. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. To Arascaeta. Brilliantly cut out. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Hops for safety. And we've reached half-time. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goalless. How would you review the first half? Yeah, and despite the scoreline, it's clear who the better side is when it comes to chances. If this is the trend that's going to continue, then there's only going to be one winner here, and uh, I don't think it's going to take too much improvement for it to happen. So they head in, no further forward. The score here, still nil-nil. We're probably into the second 45 minutes. Uruguay clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Referee's given a throw. Showing good feet. Excellent challenge there, uncompromising. 
That's a throw. Bernardo Silva. Look, movement creates more options. And the shot! Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. And it's been taken short. Great lead! And it's in! There is the great lead! The attendance for this match was 71,898. No space, no problem. You just cannot stop him. Rafael Leao demonstrated great strength there. I mean, he really had to hold his man off and just create enough room for him to be able to get the shot away. I think it's just top, top play. After 60 minutes is number 15, Rafael Leao. Substitutions taking place. Ah, oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. A 1-0 lead established. Look, you can't deny that it's a blow, but this game is far from unsalvageable. Plays it through. Steered out wide, but he won't reach that one. The Araskater. So, what can they make of this? Cavani. Chance to break. Danilo Pereira. It's a pretty loose pass. Nice little ball through. Bruno Fernandes in acres of space out wide. Great hit! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Well, we were anticipating this. They're very much set up for the counter-attack, and I don't see it changing anytime soon. Substitution. Oliveira. No, he wasn't going to let him pass. There will be a throw in. Pass is intercepted. And it's Luis Suarez to Arascaeta. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Pelisci. No, it's not getting there. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Bruno Fernandes. He is through here. Oh, this is a terrific run. Another pass just keeps it ticking over. João Cancelo is fouled. Substitution in progress. Bentancur has got the wrong side of the referee and got himself a yellow card for his troubles. Yeah, and the ref told him it was coming, and he still failed to heed the warning. Gets into some There'll space, and that's a surprise to hit! It's run loose, who's going to get there? Luis Suarez. Nice interception. His positioning was spot on. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. Always in the balance. And in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. I've been in this position myself, and this will be difficult to take. They did everything right but Please score. Sure but at least I suppose they can reflect on a few positives from this one. The regional police department.
Many thanks to Jim, and with that, it is a very good night to you.